Hello, my name is Hannah Fisher, and I am voting yes for a new library for Belmont. When I first came to Belmont more than a decade ago, the first thing I did was put my daughter in a stroller and walk straight to the library to register for a library card. A library speaks volumes about a community. It is a special place that embodies the values and the strengths of its residents. The library is unique in its ability to mirror the needs of the community, from a baby who crawls around the children's room during story time to a child who participates in the summer reading program, a teen who finds a place where they can feel safe and accepted, adults who participate in ELL conversation groups, seniors who have a place to sit and read when it's too hot or too cold or when they want company. The library is the only free facility in Belmont that is open to absolutely everyone. You don't need to buy a cup of coffee to occupy a table. You don't need to buy a ticket to attend a concert or pay a fee for a class. You are always welcome to walk in and have your needs met. When I first became aware of the critical physical conditions of the library, I was shocked. On the surface, yes, the building looks dated, but it's what lies beneath the surface that made me want to get involved. A library must be open and accessible to everyone. When someone in a wheelchair can't even access the main floor of the library, we have failed to meet their needs. When a child is turned away from a program because the children's room is grossly undersized, we have failed to meet their needs. When the building is closed because something has broken, heat, air conditioning, flooding, we have failed to meet the needs of everyone who relies on the library. Belmont is at a crossroads. It is not hyperbole to say that we are at risk of losing the heart of our community. The building is failing. We need a new library for Belmont. When I think about living in a town without a library, I think about whether a decade ago I would have decided to make Belmont my home. I think about the first trip to the library and my new library card. And this is why I will vote yes library on November 8th.